viewers, welcome back to Let's Play Free Space Blue Planet Age of Aquarius. So, yeah, problems. Also, thank you, mod builders, for throwing 12 dragons at me and watching me run around like a chicken with my head cut off, because, you know, let's just say it's kind of scary that 50 years after the first time you ever saw a dragon fighter, you still don't have anything that can keep up with it? I mean, half a century worth of development, and the thing still flies circles around us. Oh, man. But we're not here to reminisce about that time I almost got killed a dozen times by dragons. No, we're here to continue on the campaign, and that's what we're gonna do. Wait, I know that shape. That's the Lucifer. That was, I think it's Lucifer. Was it the same? Yes, yeah, Lucifer. That looks like an Earth city. Um, no, that can't be right. I blew up the Lucifer. Our analysts have finished recovering data from the escape pod found in the debris field around Earth. What they found appears to be a recording taken shortly before the escape pod lost main power. An autopsy of the escape pod's inhabitants concluded that they had been dead for several decades. Time stamping data on the footage confirms these findings. Attached is an encrypted copy of the footage, accessible only by those of commander rank and higher. That's not too too bad. Oh, okay, well, it's... Another in-game cutscene. Okay, oh, I'm gonna shut up. The information you have just received is classified. Dissemination of said information is punishable under the GTVA Security Act, Deneb Convention. Um, alright. I'm a little confused. So... The time stamping several decades old. Let, let's run through this here, viewers. Feel free to just skip the next video, because I'm going to ramble for a bit here. The video is several decades old. So that would put it at the very, very earliest, several decades, Free Space 2-ish, around then, 20-ish 20, 20 so years. Even then, the Orion should have been firing back with beam weapons, and it wasn't. In fact, 
The Lucifer was the only ship using beam weapons, and we never saw another Lucifer in Free Space 2, which would mean that this would have to have happened between Free Space 1 and Free Space 2. So it looks like the viewer commentary may be correct in that the Shemans may have found another way into Soul System. Of course, that means that there's also another Lucifer out there. And, well, we never did get a chance to match up the new beam weaponry against her. The Colossus, back in Free Space 2, was designed to be able to take the firepower from the Lucifer and retaliate, with its beam weapons punching through the Lucifer's you-can't-hurt-us shield. But that was never really put to the test. I mean, we've got even better ships now. I'm assuming the Raynor is more powerful. The Orestes that we've got, the Raynor class, but... Yeah, that was... Stepping away from the storyline, that was a really well-done in-game cutscene. I wonder how long it took to actually program that and pull it off. Either way, it looks like... Any recommendations? Nope, no recommendations. Man, no kills at all. I was terrible in that mission. It's neat how they do those. Alright, well, viewers, um, that was a quick one. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you back. And what kind of storyline revelations we get from the fact that there is apparently another Lucifer out there somewhere. See you then.